We are called to be with God in prayer and to be out to proclaim Christ and the message of the gospel. Dear brothers and sisters, in the book of prophet Isaiah chapter 6, we have a vision of the Lord in the temple. Isaiah seeing this vision says, Woe is me, for I am lost, for I am a man of unclean lips. Then the seraphim come with a burning coal and touches the mouth of the prophet saying, Behold, this has touched your lips. Your guilt is taken away and your sin forgiven. Then Isaiah hears the voice of the Lord saying, Whom shall I send? And Isaiah immediately said, Here am I, send me. In today's gospel, we have Jesus choosing his twelve apostles and gives them authority over unclean spirits to cast out and to heal every disease and every affliction saying, Go to the lost sheep. In other words to say, Jesus chose his twelve apostles to be with him and to be sent out to continue the mission of him. The apostles were all simple, ordinary, common people who had their own limitations and failures. But it is Jesus who made these ordinary men to be an extraordinary fishers of men. Jesus precisely chose his twelve apostles to be with him and to be sent out to continue the mission of proclaiming the good news to the poor. The very word apostle signifies one who is sent out. It is a word for an envoy or ambassador. The Christian is therefore the ambassador of Christ to men. We are called to be with God in prayer and to be out to proclaim Christ and the message of the gospel. In this way, each one of us becomes the apostle of Christ and our identity is to become the messengers or apostles of Christ. Saint Dominic, the founder of an order of preachers known as Dominicans, had the motto, speak to God and speak about God. In other words to say, to be with God in prayer and to go out to the world and proclaim the good news of Christ. Today's Gospel invites each one of us to speak to God and speak about God, in other words, to be with Him and to be sent out to proclaim the good news and values of the Gospel to the world. Let us ask the grace of the Lord that we too may become a true chosen instrument of God to be with Him and to be sent out to proclaim the person of Christ and the values of the Gospel which He taught. Amen. Amen.